one past five in the morning, we're in the van, the suns are shining, it's a beautiful day, and we've got something a bit different for you all today, but Matty, tell them. Well, viewers, before we were magnet fishermen and metal detectorists, we were serial car booters. We used to go to Armingall car boot, half and park and ride car boot all the time, fill up the van with tap for our girlfriends, our family, ourselves. Yeah, so we're on the way now, wallet's full of cash, and we're gonna get some bargains, aren't we, Leggett? God to hell, me, that's hot in here, what you done? Oh, I know you like it hot, Leggett, look at the wind now. Right, a little piece of camera for you quickly. I'm in hall car boot, it's you need to get up earlier. We were sat there for half hour, that's dead, there's no one there. We're going to Harford first, so get back to you on that one. Right, viewers, a little bit of a tip for you. Take your wad of cash, but make sure you've got some coins in your pockets of all denominations, just in case there's any negotiating that goes down. You don't want to hand over a quid when you're negotiating for a 50p teddy bear. Yeah, Miller loves the teddies. And remember everyone, take your own bag or rucksack with plenty of pouches and compartments. Save the planet and all, you don't know when you might need a bit of bag. Right guys, two lines down, I'm free teddies up. When I said bye for your family, I meant your dogs as well. One dog, two dog, three dog, two quid bargain. Chairs for all your chair needs. Leg it, watch out, mate. You're reading your comics. What you got there? Well, mate, look at these. I'm a happy boy. The Beano, the Beano, the Beano. Now these are old. 1982. Let's have a look at the date. Look at that, Miller. See that there? Lovely. Now, let me tell you, the bloke, he reckoned at 50p each for these. I said, mate, if I took all three, would you take a quid? He said, yes. Now, We've had a look on eBay, haven't we? We've had a little look. How much? How much? 400 quid a piece. 400 quid? What's that? That's about 40,000 percentage up mark, isn't it? We better get going before he finds out. All the hustle and bustle you Right, you know we like our metal detector. You got a Harvard Eureka metal detector. Look at that piece. She's a beauty from the past times. Right guys, Leggett did a bit of negotiating and got this for a couple of quid. Even if it don't work as an antique, but let's plug it in and see if it does work. New battery in. Down. Fine tuning. On. Coarse tuning. On. Leggett, that don't work. Maybe I don't want it as an antique. Should we go and get... I'm gonna go and get my money back. We've just dumped stuff off at the van and I'm Delia Smith's number one fan. To the cake lady! I was thinking what it'll look like after a blitz. You take two quid for this one. Yeah, go on. Yeah, legend. Lovely selection down there. Lovely. I'll have an what? unboxing in the van, I reckon, Leggett. Should yeah. we go and have a look what we got? Yes, mate. Right, we couldn't help ourselves with cracking into some already. Come down, Harford Park and ride car boot. Go see the cake lady and get a cake. Beautiful. Mention the dippy detectorists. Ooh. Another one? I reckon so. Harming all. You have reached your destination. Ooh, it's popping, boy, it's popping. That's busier than earlier, Leggett. How you feeling, Leggett, walking up to the car boot? Well, a bit nervous, a bit apprehensive, a bit excited. Let's get down there and see what bargains we can get a day, boy. Right, viewers, I've been looking for Leggett for a couple of hours around this car boot. I've lost him. We're supposed to be making my van doors open. Leggett, what are you eating without me? Strawberries? What's you going on? You caught me, Miller. You caught me, boy. Right, if you're going to go to the cake lady at Harford, you've got to bounce out with some goodies, haven't you? Strawberries, £2 a pullet. Got to be healthy. Right, viewers, I found a bargain here, and I bought them from some fellow magnet fishermen. Here is a Beatles vinyl, one Beatles vinyl, two Beatles vinyls. Do you know what I got them for? Three for a tenner. There's a Tracy Chapman behind there too. Anyway, I know that one of the blokes in the Beatles, his name's Paul McCartney. Let's give him a call. Hello? Yeah, yeah, can you guess who it is? Yeah, that's Miller. Hello, Paulinho, how you doing all right? Yeah, not too bad. Well, I'm just up arming all car boot. I've just found two of your vinyl records. I was wondering if you wanted them back. I mean, I'd do you a deal on it and that. You know I buy your wife sausages a lot. Linda McCartney, you know me and Leggett are both 
well, we're vegetarian, aren't we? Yeah, yeah. Well, the price, you know, you know us. Grand each. Yeah, yeah. He's hung up on me. You know what, Leggett? That hang-up is not going to stop me. Let's go and get some more bargains. Here, here, Leggett. I've just had a tip off. There's an antique spirit level on row one. Come and have a look. Is that them, Miller? They are beautiful, yeah, aren't they, Leggett? Beautiful. He's slinging stuff in. I the reckon I can make a bid on this. How much are your spirit levels again? I want a tenner for that one. Yeah. And 15 for each one of them. You wouldn't take a bid on the on the Diddy one? Not really, mate, because they make, see, that's just, I mean, they are, they are a nice thing. Yeah. I mean, you've got them in there, they've got to be more. Now. Fair enough. And it's from my dad to father. Yeah, <laughs> well, there you go. Tenor. Don't be such a toy. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> 15 dinner. <laughs> yeah. Let's call that's it 20. <laughs> there you go. Thank you, Mole Sugar. Thank you so much. Come and have a look at this leggy. This is an antique spirit level. Birmingham, made in England. J. Rabone and Sons, warranted corrected. Now, this is a beauty, and it's for Father's Day for my dad. Dad, I hope you like it. What? Hold on a minute, leggy. That hasn't got the bubble in it. He's done us. Let's go. Miller, Miller. What's up, Miller, leggy? Look at this. Leggy. I've found it. What is it? Norfolk car boots, wholesome treasures. This is a teapot from the Pyramids of Giza. One of Cleopatra's bodyguards used to drink his tea out of this one. You're joking. No, I didn't. Look at that. Lovely. I wonder if there's some tea in there for me. There ain't tea. There's a message. What? What's this? Let's have a look at this one. Blimey, there's hieroglyphics on there. Let's have a look like it. DD? Let's have, let's have a look at this, Miller. There's a message on there. DD. Please return to Dodgy Damien at Caravan 27.5 up Skeggy. Now viewers, you may know from our evidence found video previously, Dodgy Damien's been on the run because Constable Filler framed me and put me behind bars. Now, aren't we headed up Lincoln Way for our Dippies on Tour video, Miller? Yeah, and Skeggy's on the way. We've got the address now. He's in trouble, let's pay that man a visit. So here we are, we've just finished up at Arming All Car Boot. Car booted and looting we were. We found some beautiful finds today. My favorite find was this antique spirit level. I went back to the bloke and he put the bubble in for an extra two quid. What a gent he was. Dad, I hope you're happy. What do you reckon, Leggett? I reckon my favorite find is this lovely little teapot from the Pyramids of Giza. This evidence will put dodgy Damien behind bars for a plenty of time. Good, I hate that man. To be fair, Miller, I'm getting car boot fever. Do you want to do our own stall? What, and sell our magnet fishing finds at this car boot? Yeah, there's one this Wednesday. Let's go and get set up. Plenty of grands.